Okay, so could you tell us your name and where you're working? Okay, uh, my name is Elmer Rivera, and uh, I'm a teacher here at Cape Vista Bay Academy. Um, I teach 8th grade uh, social studies and also 8th grade uh, technology class. How have you used the um, Linux lab so far this mm -hmm. year? So we're now in February, so we're several months into the school year. And what we've been using the lab for is to uh, support and assist the 8th graders, uh, in particular uh, applying to various high schools um, and to support them in researching for their different projects for their individual classes. So they just completed a research project uh, for their English class. So we spent a lot of time working on research skills. Um, and they also were working with Google Docs, writing their papers um, and sharing that with uh, their teacher. Uh, so that's one thing that, that they've done uh, recently. Um, they just finished up working on a science assignment with uh, Mr. Repberg, uh, working on uh, Google Docs once again, uh, but their presentation software. So they worked on presentations. Uh, once again, you know, research skills, so working on the presentation, and they actually, uh, in the classroom, were, were using Google Docs. They had access to the Internet, and they were presenting um, their, their research topics in, in science class. And so a lot of it has very much been trying to support them and helping them access the uh, technology that is out there. So once they go to high school next year, they'll be a little more independent um, and, and not uh, always kind of relying on the teacher on some level uh, for you know what to do, but that they have you know, various skills that, that at their disposal uh, for them to be able to use. The network should be faster this year. Have you noticed any change in speed, or does it seem pretty much the same? As far as the network, um, I would say it's uh, more, one, reliable, and I would definitely say faster. Since the beginning of the year, um, especially kind of working in, our, in my class with the U.S. history, working on having them understand the, the election, and, and they were very much interested in researching about Obama. There was a ton, a ton, a ton out there on the Internet, um, and so they wanted to have access to, to you know, videos. And uh, there were definitely, you know, a couple speeches and a couple of the videos that I wanted them to have access to. And that was one way that this year we were able to test the system, whereas in years past, not as much. Um, and uh, the lab itself has, has responded well. Uh, we, we found a couple, you know, kinks here and there. Um, and we found that if we actually downloaded uh, one of the particular videos, uh, just, you know, a, a couple minutes beforehand, and that could have been me or that could have been another student going downstairs, it, it definitely worked to make uh, it easily accessible for all students. Um, but we did find um, at first that if all students were trying to access that video at the same time, um, there was a bit of a lag. And that's one thing that, that we, you know, worked on. Uh, to try to, you know, work around. But I think that's more so just, so it's not Linux itself, it's just the, the, the computers that we have down there. Um, and better than last year, I would say, but at, at times if we're all trying to watch, let's say, 10 different videos, um, there, there can be a bit of a lag time. That's one thing that we have noticed. Um, but, you know, we found ways to kind of work around that, I would say, and, and been pretty effective at it. Um, to use the analogy of, you know, water in the toilet, um, that if you just have, you know, one uh, pipe that's going to you know, provide all the water and everybody flushes at the same time, you're going to run out. Uh, but if you have a basin uh, of, of water, then, you know, there's clearly going to be enough that everybody have access to. And so when we go down there and we download that one video, you know, it, it's set and it's ready to go. So it, it's almost... <laughs> It's instantaneous. You know, the minute uh, students, you know, log in, they have access to it, it's, it's, it's ready to go. And that was pretty impressive, um, where I thought there was going to be far more of a lag time and, and, and some stalling and this and that. Um, but once we, we actually were able to download it first, it, it worked quite well. And, you know, if the students are not kind of antsy, then you can tell it definitely has worked well. <laughs> and so they knew they could sit down and watch it, no problem. Um, I would say that's one thing this year that definitely... Um, we've worked on, whereas in years past, we, we're still trying to kind of work things out.